Adventures in Pixie Land presents your daily energy reading. Your daily astrology reading for September 13th, 2024 is the waxing gibbous moody moon in practical Capricorn. Trine, innovative Uranus in steadfast Taurus. Curiosity will be what pulls you out of your comfort zone today. Some people just can't resist an efficiency. Your Elder Futhark Daily Rune for September 13th, 2024 is Ansuz. Ansuz, the letter A, meaning God, Chieftain, reference to Odin. Associations, mind, voice within, signals, inspiration, true vision, self-knowledge. Today, your focus is on your connection to source consciousness. You might be noticing synchronicities or signals from the universe that you are on the right path. Your daily romance angel oracle card for September 13th, 2024 is Reconciliation. Reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. This card can, indicates that a ex-lover may be re-entering your life. The first person you think of is likely who it'll be. The purpose of this reconciliation is to achieve healing and closure with respect to your past. You will understand more about yourself and see your relationship patterns more clearly. You'll also take responsibility for the role you played in relationship drama, which will free you from the tyranny of unforgiveness. Reconciliations are ultimately about taking care of unfinished business. This card could also mean possibly making peace with a family member or friend. Each relationship is a sacred learning experience. So be open to this reunion's lessons and blessings Ultimately, all healings help your love life and every other part of your world. Your Daily Fairy Wisdom Oracle card for September 13th, 2024 is The Flirt. Card 31. The Flirt. Attention. Smile at everyone you see today. We all know that a little flirting could be fun. Fairies love to flirt. It's just part of their personality. Some are flirtier than others, however. We have all done it from time to time. A bit too much bite might be another thing altogether. Are you being true to another who cares about you? Are you being true to your own values? Are you trifling with another's emotions? Is it possible that someone is taking your attention more seriously than you intended? Check to make sure that you are not harming another. Are you getting involved in something that is not good for you? Be careful not to flirt with danger. See things clearly and be truthful with yourself. Pay attention to that little voice within and its warnings. This card may also be telling you that opportunity is within reach, but that you are only flirting with it. If there is something that you really want to do, sink all your efforts into the project. Avoid being superficial in your actions. If it's worth doing, it's worthy of your full attention. Your chant? Fluttering about my head. Have you heard what I've just said? Fairies, dear as you can be, help to bring my truth through me. So be it. Your daily star seed oracle card for September 13th, 2024 is the Cosmic Heart. The Cosmic Heart, Devotion, Potency, make your life a moving prayer. When you surrender to the state of devotion, you find yourself flowing with all of life. You're being called to refocus your attention deep within to the intelligence of your own heart. To bow with deep reverence to your inner temple. 
to live your life in devotion to this place, to make your life one big moving prayer. Perhaps you felt a bit off kilter lately, sensing that the potency of why you're doing things has gotten a little watered down or weak. Perhaps you've forgotten what made you start doing them in the first place. If so, this is your call to take a moment and reconnect with the truth at the very center of your heart, to get back the essence of what you're about, to devote your life to what you care most about, to turn your gaze deep, 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 deep. There are seasons for harvesting and seasons for sowing. Right now, you're being called to plant your soul seed and to sing to them with deep devotion, to feed them with the sweetest waters of your own soul, to lose yourself in the potency of what it is that most expands your heart, to live your life according to what makes you come alive rather than what everyone else thinks, to make your life one big moving prayer. Your starseed soul inquiry, how can you make your life a moving prayer? Your Daily Priestess of Light Oracle card for September 13th, 2024 is Adjustment. Adjustment. Looking back, moving forward. The Priestess of Wisdom pauses, looking over her shoulder as she receives owl guidance about adjustments to be made before moving forward. This card marks a pause in your energy, a time to contemplate what changes, if any, would be beneficial. Reflection and course correction are now wiser than charging full steam ahead. The owl has extraordinary vision. It can adjust its focus from telescopic to microscopic in an instant. In fact, it is always adjusting, always ready to redirect its path for a more effective result. This card is suggesting that you do the same. Review your previous choices to determine what has worked for you. Look ahead to see what changes can accelerate your plan's fruition. This could call for some patience and courage, for you may have to shift or even abandon the path that has been your primary focus. But take note of the bright light from the right, the future, pouring into the priestess of wisdom's left hand, the hand of receiving, as well as the orbs there and at her third eye. She is guided in adjustment by clarity and the vision of the owl, as well as being directed into the future by the lights and the orbs of the spirit world. You too can be so guided when you let yourself stop, reconsider, adjust, and move peacefully forward with trust. Your affirmation, it is safe for me to stop and reconsider my path and process. I am patient and courageous in the choices and changes that I make. Your daily energy reading for September 13th, 2024 is the astrology is telling you to play the game of find the efficiency. On the Sue's says creator is calling today. The romance oracle says the past returns to the present. The fairies remind you to be honest with people around you as gently as you can put it. The starseed oracle says you can talk to creator whenever you want and 
in every or any everything and anything you do the priestess of light oracle is saying it's time to pivot so there is something about this person likely a person the romance oracles the cards are almost always people so there's something about this person from the past the creator is bringing to the present. And you need to find the efficient yet gentle way to explain something to this person. To get the message clear without being aggressive. So I suppose that would be the challenge. I'm not sure what the nature of the relationship was between the two of you. Because it could be any, I mean, that's going to depend, individuals. Now, it might also be, because this is somewhat, sometimes what happens, it might not be the same people from the past, but it might be a different person, but a situation like you were in in the past. Because that's very frequently what it also is, but... You're pretty specifically being told not to respond the same way you did. For whatever that means. When you encounter this. Because it's going to be impossible to say to many people. It's impossible for me to even say about my own life. I have way too many people in my life. Creator's going to need to be more specific. I've made a lot of changes in the last few years. That means that's a lot of people that are technically considered the past. Now I'm excluding, you know, people I talk to on a regular basis because they're not the past. They're the present. They're in, they were in the past, but they're also in the present. So who knows? Just remember. No matter how they come at you, you are supposed to respond with dignity, grace, and respect for both of you. Firm is fine. Truthful, also beautiful, but gentle. Because he's being specific here. Gently honestly pivot it's game think of it as almost like a conversation frogger 